Hey, everybody. We're going to try to do something scary. Maybe I need to do a trigger warning first. Trigger warning. This is actual American history. This is a Confederate sword known to trigger woke little bitches. If you are a woke bitch and things like historical objects hurt your little wimpy ass feelings, please move on from my page and go watch cats licking each other in basements that you dwell in. Anyway, hey guys, Brian Akins, rebelrelics.com. I've got a killer, killer. Maybe it actually did kill somebody, which could trigger somebody else. Good God, this will be hard to get through. Confederate, I said Confederate. Oh God, somebody else is triggered. Calvary Saber, it's gonna be hard to get through this without your sensitive ass getting offended, but let's give it a go. Guys, Confederate sword, unstopped fuller. There are some with a little half ricasso. This one isn't it. This one, I believe, in my opinion, which I'm allowed to have, used to be allowed to have an opinion. Now you can't anymore. Notice the stipling in this uh, sand casting. I think that is a sign of a Bull and Gamble product. The single strand brass wire is also a Bull and Gamble trait. Got EJ on the camera this morning. I want him to get in there on that, uh, that file finish on that pommel cap. Let's look at the butt. That probably didn't trigger most of these boys. <laughs> See how that right there, guys? The patina is smooth. The butt cap is smooth. He said butt. That's what you want to see. When they rehandle these swords, maybe add new wood or new leather, new brass wire, that's always got a different patina or, or, or it's rough or you can just tell it's been monkeyed with. The grip is original. It is a little salty. You can see some shrinkage from age. I hear stuff shrinks with age. I ain't that old yet. All right, guys. In my opinion, which we used to be able to have in America, this is a bull and gamble Confederate cavalry saber. I'm sure some lame right now is going, oh, no, that's not a bull and gamble. I watched three episodes of Antique Road Pickers and... Uh, save it. And guys, I started filtering all my comments. So when you idiots start putting comments in there, that's not real. That uh, I'm not even going to post it. And I'm not even going to reply anymore. Guys, I'm still hot from them canceling a video. If you're into cancel culture and woke, what are you going to do one day? You're just going to watch hot two videos all day long because you got rid of everything that might stimulate you to get off the couch. Maybe do something with your life besides so live off your mama or your dad or can't wait for your mom to die so you can inherit the freaking house. Oh, you people suck. I'm Brian Akins, RebelRelics.com, and I approve this message, and if you don't, I don't care. See you.